honest to God split right now for Javante Tank Davis versus Shakur Stevenson. Let's talk. Straighter, yep. not yep. a roundhouse yep. right hand. And that's what we've been talking about, the straight shot. It's exactly. the one where he gets leverage on it. I don't want to kill Pull somebody back for a, a little bit. Seconds. Nah, I want a body on my record. Now, I want to see you fight motherfuckers. I do. All right, I'm with you. I'm with you. As long as as long as you're trying to fight the great, the, your, or the, the, the best competition. Welcome to the graveyard. Take the link if you dare to. Mary, you alive, I'm prepared to. Welcome to the graveyard. You get your sources from clowns. So when you come around, we're here. Welcome to the graveyard. Take the link if you dare to. Mary, you alive, I'm prepared to. Welcome to the graveyard. You get your sources from clowns. So when you come around, we're here. You wish the best, fight the best. If you ain't with the moto, just click the link, bitch, and get buried like the rest. It ain't gonna work how you want it. These trolls already tried, too many come but don't leave. So if you hear, you gotta die. Spitting straight facts. These bitches crying cause they hate that. The LDBC's the top topic, bitch, hate that. Be the best to bring the truth to these fans. So why you hate? I'ma laugh and keep counting these bands. Come to the graveyard, click the link, get the hands. Bury you alive, I'm prepared to. Welcome to the graveyard, you get your sources from clowns, so when you come around, we don't hear you. Welcome to the graveyard, click the link if you dare to, bury you alive, I'm prepared to. Welcome to the graveyard, you get your sources from clowns, so when you come around, we don't hear you. Welcome to the graveyard. After that horrible performance from Shakur Stevenson, and the fact that Shakur Stevenson fought on a Thursday when Vegas was supposed to be packed with people for a race and other things and he was giving away thousands of tickets they were dropped all the way down to $4 and there was still entire sections that were completely empty completely empty what is the split with Giovanni Tank Davis because at this point it is without question Gervonta Tank Davis will sell that entire car. Without question. Without question, he will sell that. They will go there for Tank. Whether it's to see Tank knock this man out or to see if this man can box, outbox Tank. But they're there to for Tank. Period. There will probably be maybe a couple hundred people that will be there cheering Shakur on thinking that Shakur beats Tank. The rest of the entire state, country, will be there or looking to see when Tank knocks this man out. So with that being said, what's the split? What's the split? Shakur Stevenson ain't bringing no, he just proved when he did this by himself, because Edwin De Los Santos is no name. Shakur did this by himself. He just proved that man's not a draw at all, not even remotely close. Re not even remotely close to being a draw. Not even remotely close. So that's what he just did. His gate was probably absolute garbage. Now, I don't give a damn. I don't, I don't believe any numbers that tells me that this man did a million at the gate. This man probably did maybe 200,000. If someone shows me some numbers where, uh, oh man, he did... 1.2 million at the gate. If someone shows me any number over a quarter of a million, and it, you're, I will never believe that source again. Never. Whoever wrote that article, never in my life. You were paid. Someone paid you to put that out there. Someone paid you for those numbers. I need to see where you got them from. Because I don't believe not one of you niggas telling me that this did up. If anybody says they did a million at the gate, you're a liar. You are a liar. You are a blatant liar. Floor seats weren't even $1,000. They were selling tickets at the end of that for $4, and they still couldn't fill it up. Not even, not even remotely close. They had the cameras on certain parts of the arena where they pushed everybody down to the bottom to make it look like, no, it was still trash. It was still trash. Yeah, they were still, it still wasn't, and people were still leaving. So, I want to know what the gate was. I'm saying right now, 200,000 tops. 
and it might not even have got that. It might two hundred thousand tops, tops. I didn't see nobody walking around with no Shakur Stevenson, De La Santos merchandise. I didn't see no cups, no hats, nothing. Not a damn thing. So whoever was selling that merch, ah, y'all didn't break even. I promise you that. Y'all took a loss. You better sell them shit to Africa. Send them shits over there to the Africans. Let them, hey, send them to the, hey, send them over there, bro. You send them to the same place where they send the the, uh, the losing Super Bowl champion uh, t-shirts. Yeah, when the motherfucker, they already got all those shirts made. Uh, but for, the, for both teams, all the shirts, all the hats, the jackets, all that stuff, the cups, the, the mug, all that. The, all that stuff is made already for both teams. And whoever loses that Super Bowl, all those things get sent or overseas. Uh, hey, you better send them over there. Maybe you can collect about fifteen, twenty dollars. You know what I'm saying? Hey, that's better than nothing, man. Fifteen to twenty dollars is better than nothing. All right, it's better than nothing, man. Now, you know, once you do send it over there, and it costs you whatever it costs you to send those shirts and hats and mugs overseas, then you know you'll probably you'll probably get about twenty, twenty five, thirty dollars. And like I said, that's better than nothing. That's been, unless you're feeling frugal, you know, you want to go ahead and give them shirts. You, you know, you're feeling like a, phila a, a, a philanthropist. You want to go out and give them motherfucking shirts to the people. Well, go ahead and give them Shakur De La Santo shirts to the people, bro. I'm pretty sure there's some bums that is, is, it's the winter. It's fall. It's the winter time. And it's November. It's cold out there. I'm pretty sure somebody can use one of them hoodies. All right. So listen, man, barring all of that. No, I'm keeping it a rack with y'all, bro. Tank Davis versus Shakur Stevenson will be entirely sold by Tank Davis. I understand there's going to be people in the comments because Devin is the hottest topic in boxing. So there's going to be people in the comments saying, well, Tank versus Devin, Tank's going to sell that too. I, I know. I know, because Devin is the hottest topic in boxing. So I know in these comments, one of you goofballs is going to be like, but, but listen, but, but, but Tank is going to sell the whole fight with Devin 2, the whole thing with Devin 2. Cool. I know. So you, you, you can't go one day without bringing Devin to this. And I know. Anyways, back to the topic at hand. Because <laughs> Devin has nothing to do with this at all. What is the split for Gervonta Tank Davis and Shakur Stevenson? What is the split? Nobody told this man. No one told him to fight Edward De La Santos. He could have gave Frank Martin some more money. He could have did that and fought Frank Martin. That fight would have sold tremendously. Facts. So many people who refused to go to this one would have showed up for that. Absolutely would have showed up for that. You had the backstory with Errol Spencer, Terrence Crawford. You had all that. It was all there. And you threw it away for a couple of bucks. Yeah, you threw it away because you didn't want to give him a little bit more. Because you were fucking greedy. You wanted to keep 75% of the bag for yourself. So so you didn't want to give, uh, you didn't want to do to uh, for Frank what you wanted Devin to do for you. Since you didn't want to do it, that's what you got. A bum-ass fight against a bum who hurt you and actually beat you. I don't care what anybody say. I don't give a damn what y'all say. Edwin beat that man. Edwin is a WBC champion right now. Edwin is Devin, should be Devin's mandatory. Edwin, he beat that man. I don't give a damn what y'all say. I know what I watched. He beat that man. Whatever. But I know you guys are going to say, oh, man, no, that fight wasn't close, BF. I disagree. Shakur Stevenson beat that man easy by running around the ring, getting body shots landed on him. And then dashing off, throwing a jab here and a jab here and a jab there. These are the same people that said, oh, man, Devin, Devin's trash, man. All he used was a jab to beat uh, George Campos. All he used was a jab. He used a jab. He used a jab to beat George Campos. Devin landed more jabs against George Campos in a round and a half than Shakur Stevenson threw punches the entire fight. Every punch he threw the entire fight, Devin threw more jabs. He Not even threw. He landed more jabs on George Cambosis in a round and a half. Landed more jabs 
than, Sha- than all the punches Shakur Stevenson threw the entire fight. But I know that's different to you guys. Y'all don't care about that. Whatever. I, I know. I know. Back to the subject at hand. I just want to know the split. I want to know what you now, what what you guys believe is a realistic, logical, and honest to God split that we that we that Tank Davis can give this man so that we can get the fight we want. That's all I'm asking. What is the split? Because it damn sure ain't 50-50, because that's what he wanted with Devin. If this man asks for 50-50 to fight Tank Davis, somebody needs to punch this nigga in the face. If this man asks for 50-50 to fight Tank Davis, what someone needs to do, you know, back in the day, uh, them, them old school comedies where you'll take a pie and smash a pie in somebody's face, somebody needs to keep a, 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 a pie with all kinds of whipped cream on deck. So if this man asks for 50-50, demands 50-50 with Gervonta Tank Davis, somebody needs to just smash a pie right in his face and walk off. Don't even say nothing. Just smash the pie in his face and walk off. The only thing we should hear as soon as they says, listen, that shit dead. Because, listen, 50-50, I, I'm a champion too. I, I'm a real boy now. As soon as he says that, just smash the pie in his face. Only we should hear is womp, womp, womp. That should be the that should all we nobody should be talking. We shouldn't hear no 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 uh 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 no com, no 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 counters no nothing. Listen, bro. Listen, bro. You just did my watch. How many how how much how much uh 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 the gate your gate your viewership was not my watch cost more than what you made for the viewership the fucking gate. Merchandise, all that. My watch costs more. So if this man, if Shakur Stevenson says he wants anything more, anything more than a flat fee, <laughs> smash the pie in his face and walk off. Womp, womp, womp. There's your negotiations right there. Tank's people should go to the table with Shakur Stevenson with a fresh pie sitting on the table. A fresh one. So as soon as they say, okay, we we gonna offer you uh three million dollars and five percent pay-per-view. Three million flat and five percent pay-per-view. That's what we're giving. Three million flat. So then he say, that that shit dead. That they offer me three point five. They have offered me 3.5. How you gonna offer me three million and five percent? They have offered me twenty-five percent. Hey, you I want fifty fifty. Pop! They, the, the lawyer should have the pie in hand. So he should he should sit there at the table, have the pie right there, fresh, fresh warm pie. Have himself a thing of, of cool whip, uh, and tell him, listen, we're gonna give you three million. You know, and just spraying the spraying the pool the cool whip on top of the pie, the whole can if they can, just the whole can. Listen, we're gonna give you three million flat, and five percent of the pay per views. Set the can down and pick the pie up and hold it in his hand. And then, so Shakur can start saying, that, that shit dead. That, that, that shit dead. Listen, how, how you gonna give me three million? Dead off me 3.5. How you gonna give me three million? You Tank Davis is supposed to be the money man. It's supposed to be the biggest fight of my career. It's supposed to be the biggest money I'm gonna make in my career. And blah, blah, blah. It's supposed to be the money man. Blah, blah, blah. Listen, I, 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 listen, uh, dead off me 25%. How you gonna give me three million and five percent? Listen, I, 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 I want 50-50. Pop! Smack. As soon as he says 50-50, just smash it in his face. As soon as this man says he wants 50-50 with Tank Davis, smash the pie in his face and walk out. Negotiations over with. <laughs> that's it, bro. How, no, that's it. If you if you even bring up 50-50, smash the pie in his face. I don't even care if he's talking about his last fight. That man can't even mention. Don't even bring up 50 Cent. If you start talking about rappers, talk about Lil Baby. <laughs> don't if you go in there, if you go in the room. With Tank's people. And y'all sit at the table. Do not bring up 50 Cent at all. I'm, I'm talking about 50 Cent, the rapper. Don't bring him up. At all. At all. Don't don't say time out because somebody might think you saying half. Don't say time out. <laughs> don't say time out. Don't, none of that. The, you can say time out. Don't do the gesture. Because if you're doing a gesture, it can make somebody think that you're saying you want 50-50 with Tank and you're going to get a pie smashed in your face. All right, so don't even do the gesture. 
All right, just just go in the room. You can start that shit dead. You can say all that goofy shit. Don't if you mention 50-50, somebody needs to smash a pie in his face and walk out. There don't even need to be no conversation, no more. 50-50 with Javante Tech Davis. The Lord, listen, the lawyers should swing on it. Hey, listen, the lawyer should swing on it. If this man says 50-50, the lawyer should swing on it. Dead ass serious. Somebody needs to swing on this man. 50-50 with Tank Davis. Just steal on him right there. Let's see. Check his upper body movement at the table. <laughs> check his upper body movement right there. Let's just see how good your upper body movement is while you sitting down. This man said 50-50. Swing on him. Swing on him. <laughs> Ain't no way in the hell this man can even mention... that. I, I understand you shoot for the stars, you land on the moon. This man's stars is 30%. That's his stars. That's Pluto. This man go to the negotiating table with your fine tank Davis. Shoot for the stars, man. Shoot for the next, shoot for Andromeda. Tell him you want 30%. From the jump. All right? Now, now I understand. You got... You, you shooting for some stuff right there. Talk about 30%. But at least you won't, at least the lawyer won't swing on you. At least they won't throw the pie in your face because you're not that stupid to ask Gervonta Tank Davis for 50 50. You bring absolutely nothing to the table. Nothing. Nothing. Your belt means nothing to Tank. Devin had all of them and Tank wasn't giving him nothing. So your one means absolutely nothing. What Tank, what Tank is worried about is the money you generate and you don't generate nothing. You generate less than Terrence Crawford. And they thought, uh, well, you know, we're losing money on Terrence Crawford. Well, how much money do you think they lost on that? So again, you guys let me know in the comments. What do you think the split should be for Giovanni Tank Davis and Shakur Stevenson? For me, 5%. I think that man should get a flat fee, no more than $3 million, and 5% of the pay-per-views. That's what I think. You guys let me know what y'all think. BFTP, shout out to the mighty, mighty LDBC. I'm out.